how to calculate the distance between genomes and what is the genome sorting problem. Calculating a distance between genomes is a way to measure the genetic divergence between different species or different populations within the species. The idea is simple. Species that have diverged relatively recently have more genetic material in common, which will result in a shorter distance. In other words, a short distance between the genomes of two species indicates that they are possibly closely related and have a relatively recent common ancestor. Being able to calculate the distance between genomes is a useful tool in comparative genomics as it is necessary for many different types of analyses. For example, distances between genomes can be used to reconstruct trees to represent the evolutionary relationships between species. There are different ways to calculate distances between two genomes, which are often going to be represented as gene orders. It all depends on the chosen model and the evolutionary events allowed on it. For example, one can calculate the reversal distance when comparing two gene orders. The reversal distance corresponds to the minimum number of inversions, or reversals, that are needed to transform one gene order into the other. The genome sorting problem consists of determining the shortest sequence of events that can transform one genome, or one gene order, into another. This shortest sequence of events is the one that minimizes the evolutionary cost, or the total number of evolutionary events. The problem is easy when both genomes contain a single copy of each gene in each genome. However, if there is more than one copy of the same gene, then the problem is hard, simply because there is no obvious one-to-one -one relationship between the copies of one genome versus the ones of the other. In other words, we cannot assume that the first copy of gene A in the first genome corresponds to the first copy of gene A in the other genome. As a result, all the possibilities of one-to-one -one relationships between the gene copies need to be taken into consideration to find the best possible solution, which obviously requires a lot of computation. 